Good morning, everybody. Welcome to yet another episode of the bottom line here at the top headline. It's travel industry likely to reach 35 to 40 percent revenue of pre pandemic level this fiscal sacral ratings. Indigo offers up to 10 percent to vaccinated passengers. Britain wants to allow people to travel again, says Minister. FICCI urges government to support tourism and hospitality industry. Vistara announces 48 hour sale for August 1 to October 12 travel period. One year since COVID-19 outbreak, tourism in Nilgiri is down by 80%. According to the Crystal Ratings report, the travel and tourism industry is likely to reach 35-40% to 40% revenue of the pre-pandemic level in the current financial year. Manish Gupta, Senior Director Crystal Ratings said, with states beginning to ease restrictions and vaccination rates expected to improve, we see domestic travel picking up slowly from the second quarter. However, segments such as international holidays and inbound travel may see recovery only in the second half and that too only if travel restrictions are eased in foreign countries. Indigo is offering up to a 10% discount on the base fare to customers who have been vaccinated against COVID-19. Passengers who are partially or fully vaccinated and located in India at the time of booking can avail of this discount. The offer is valid only on the Indigo website. Sanjay Kumar, Chief Secretary and Revenue Officer Indigo said this offer will not only strengthen their resolve towards vaccination but also ensure that they can travel safely at affordable fares with Indigo. Britain wants to allow people to travel abroad again for a foreign holiday but new variants of the novel coronavirus are complicating plans to relax its rules. George Eustace, Environment Secretary UK said, I want us to get back to a position where we can support those who want to travel to do so, nobody likes the draconian restrictions we have had to put in place over this last year. That's all we have for you in today's edition of The Bottom Line. Stay tuned for more such travel industry updates. Have a great day.